And uh, I can see the solid white line on the right hand side. Uh, looking at the warning sign, it gives us the right hand bend, left hand bend. And uh, I'm going to plan to drop a gear to settle the bike down on the way in so I'm not breaking heavy into the corner. I'm going to relax the elbow so I can feel the grip. Trying to hold a wide line with the throttle, then ease off to make the bike oversteer into a good position for the left hander. Looking at easing off round about now. Being careful not to cross that white line on the way in. I'm ready to oversteer in case somebody comes and nips the corner off. Just by nudging the inside bar away from me. And on throttle and away. Information about the bend can be picked up really early so you can plan ahead. Look out for road paint. Is there a slow sign on the road? A double white line? These all point to extra danger. And look out for road signage. Be aware of marker posts or chevrons and watch out for shaded areas under overhanging trees that can deteriorate the road surface, affecting stability and grip. Look for any cross views to give you more clues about what's going on ahead. Plan your position in advance of the bend. Use the vanishing point to assess approach speed and adjust in good time to let the bike settle after braking. Tap down to a gear that will provide more control. Reapply the throttle to hold the line, adding to widen, reducing to tighten. Keeping close to the edge of the road gives you a good view round the bend and prevents you hitting anything large that may run wide if you're too close to the white lines. Look through the bend and watch the vanishing point. You can adjust your speed as you read the bend. Grip will depend on surface conditions. This position allows you to see round the left-hander and any potential hazards. Be aware the white lines may be slippery in other conditions. Tighten up the line by pushing the inside bar away gently. As you exit the bend, apply more throttle as grip increases and the bike straightens. Be aware of pushing the front tire. Now, 